Hi everybody, welcome back to Power Slide episode 3. I'm Ian Gray. It's going to be all time for all metal all day today. Let's do this! Hello, hello, music lovers and metalheads. Welcome back to Power Slide. I'm Ian Gray. This is going to be a fun one. We've got a lot of news going for you, so here we go. Let's just do some national news for you right now. The QNC uh, Expo Center in Ringo, Wisconsin is going to be hosting Nonpoint with Emperors and Elephants on May 12th, Saturday, so that'll be a lot of fun. They're going to be playing with Sumo Psycho, Narcissus, and Paramorpheus. So if, if those sound like bands that you guys want to get into that you've probably never heard before, and that they're probably going to be pretty good, then go check them out. I'm sure that's going to be a lot of fun. And it's in Ringle, so uh, that's, that's cool. That's cool. A uh, big story, though. Big story. Northern Invasion. That's going to be happening this weekend, coming up May 12th and 13th. Oh my god, the lineup for here is pretty good. There's a lot of good solid bands on this. Event Sevenfold is going to be headlining, A Perfect Circle is going to be headlining, Tool, Alice in Chains, uh, wow. You know, Maynard James Keenan doing a double header, let's, let's see if he can do it. You know, keep punching upward, keep, keep punching upward, Maynard. We, we, we believe in you. You're going to do great. You're going to do great. I'm sure your wine is fantastic. Uh, country Punk Pioneer. Tony Kinman has died. He has passed away recently. He was 63 years old. He battled cancer for some time. Uh, condolences to the family. He was part of the Dills, Blackbird, Rank and File, and Cowboy Nation. So there you go. If you want to go pick up some of that, you probably should because it's probably going to be good stuff. Uh, uh, country Punk Pioneer. Country Punk. Uh, that, that's cool. Uh, uh, something new for the show. So there we go. Well, that's it for the national news right now. We're going to kick it over to and do some local stuff. So stick around. This is Power Slide. All right, everybody, this is going to be local stuff, so I'm glad you tuned in and stayed here with me. I mean, Greg, I didn't remember. So, anyway, here we go. This is local stuff. Endless Rain is going to have their uh, tour, their fly, fi fly fishing in a Brazilian creek tour. This one's going to be off the charts, man. They're, they're, they're an incredible show when you go, I have a patch of theirs. Check it out. Endless Rain. That's cool. So, uh, go see them. They'll be at Everybody's Bar in Chippewa Falls on May 11th as part of their tour. And they'll also be at the Wisco that same weekend on May 12th. But on the 11th, uh, uh, they'll be with uh, uh, Beer Can Pentagram and Toxic Ruin for that show. So, uh, you guys who love Toxic Ruin, love thrashing around, get out to that show, man. I want to see people moving out there. Okay? Yeah, get out and show some support. And then on the 12th, on May 12th, when they're going to be playing uh, at the Wisco in Madison, it's going to be with Seisma population control and court cost. So that, that that's also going to be another great show this weekend. This is going to be this should have a pretty good weekend. Also, at the Reptile Palace on May 12th, it's going to be sight on scene. They're going to be with Thin the Herd and Shield the Survivors, great guys, with a whole bunch of really good guys in, in uh, Shield the Survivors there. So go check out those guys at Reptile Palace. That's going to be a lot of fun, man. I love Reptile Palace. A, a great gig, great concert, great venue. Uh, Rock Garden Live they're going to have their uh, uh, feature coming up on May 17th with none other than Profane. This is going to be great. All you old school guys I know are going to love this, this stuff. Uh, if you can get down there, please go check it out. Rock Garden Live. It's going to be May 17th, Thursday. It's, going to, it's also going to be on Wisconsin CW14. So if you know that station, tune in. It's going to be great. The doors are going to open at 6 o'clock. And the show's going to start at 7. Admission fee is $10. So if you want to go and you got 10 bucks, I know you got 10 bucks. Come on, guys. All right, you got enough money for 5 bucks out the door, $10 for a drink for the night. Drinks, more drinks. Everybody can use it. It's just an extra 10 bucks. You should go. $10 out the door. Rock Garden Live, May 17th. Profane. Check it out. Also, on Sunday, May 13th, we at the BOS Meadery, the Boss Meadery, we have Viking Church for their Sunday Mass. Uh, that's going to be with Let the Wolf Speak, Delinquents, and In Dying Hours. So check that out, Sunday, May 13th, the Viking Church Mass. That's, that's going to be good stuff. Well, that's, uh, that's it for the local stuff, and uh, I'm Ian doing everything I can to keep it together. we got Album of the Week coming up, followed up by Ian's Rant, so stick around. This is going to be Album of the Week. Album of the Week! I love this part. This is great. Uh, I missed it last week. Sorry for doing it. Uh, didn't have time. Ran out of time. We, we had a whole bunch of other stuff that was going on. A whole a whole lot of things we had to do. We had to reverse from metal from us and all those other things. So uh, that out of the way. This is album of the week. Let's get to this. And this is Speed Stack, Immortal Affliction. It's five tracks. It's brutal. It's hard hitting. It, it, the name 
says it all. It, it's speed stamp. Speed stamp. Speed stamp. Speed stamp. Get it. Buy it. Go get it. It's amazing. Why haven't you seen them live yet? You probably should be. It's who again? Speed stamp. A mortal affliction. Get it. Well, album of the week. Man, that's great. This show's gone really well. I hope you guys are enjoying yourselves as well as I. And as you know, it is now time for Ian Rant. So take it away this week. Welcome, everybody. It's Ian Rant's time. Oh, my God. I got a lot on my mind. I got a lot on my mind. Okay. So check this out. When you're at a concert, you know what you should be doing? You know what you should be doing as an audience member? You should be moving around. I want to see people moving around. I want to see people moshing. I don't want to see people just standing there. If you're just going to be standing there on your phone, that's cool. You can do that, but only do it for like a second. And only if you're going to be like checking your messages if like it says it's an emergency or like say if your family member has to call you up because they have an explosive diarrhea problem. Maybe they haven't told you about it all day, but you don't need to know that anyway. You really don't need to know any of that. But you need to be moving around when you're at a show. I want to see, uh, you know, how it used to be. <laughs> I want to see people like, uh, like, oh God, you know when you see South American footage of those crazy concerts and people are jumping up on stage, diving into each other, and having a genuinely good time when you're at a show? That's what I want to see again. I don't want to see cell phones out. I don't want to see an ocean of little lights <laughs> on cameras. I want to see everybody holding up their arms as an endurance contest. Let's see how long I can hold up my phone. That's a terrible idea. You're missing the whole show. You're missing the whole point of going to a show. You know, you know having a good time hanging out with your buds, hanging out with your friends, hanging out with genuine strangers that you don't even know. Like, running into just some weirdo and being like, hey man, do you like this band? Hey, yeah, me too. That's cool. That's fun. Oh, we have a lot in common. Oh, that's, that's great. That's awesome. That's what I want to see. I want to see more activity at shows. I like that. I, I want to see more local support for local bands out there. If you guys are fans and you like going to shows, show it. Uh, buy our crap. Buy their crap. Buy everybody's crap. Everybody's got cool crap, right? Spend a little bit of money buying their crap. Maybe makes them feel good. Also pays for meals. It's really cool. So, if you're going to a show, you're going to be an audience member. Look at this here. You see how worked up you got me? <laughs> I'm so... <laughs> I'm so worked up. Even the cameraman can't keep it together. He can't keep it together. I can't keep it together. I'm so mad. Oh, God. Yeah, Ian Rance this week. Whew. Yeah, but, but that bothers me just a little. You got to be a cool audience member when you go. I know you can move. I want to see you thrashing around. I want to see you moshing. I want to see you having a good time. Because that's what it's about. That's what going to a show is all about. I don't want to see you just standing there anymore. It's, uh, it's time, time for that. It's over. Hey, maybe, maybe. Hey, if you want to stand there, uh, I don't know. Hey, well, we'll see. But in my opinion, that's, that's how the rant's got to go. And that's the way everybody's got to do it. If you're at a concert. All right, I'm getting too worked up. Getting too worked up. Got to pull back. Pull back a little. Pull back. But anyway, that's my rant this week. Just thought I'd let you know. So if you're at a show, let me see you move around a little. Well, I am just, I'm shocked. I'm blown away. That's amazing information. Thanks again, Ian. <laughs> well, thank you all again for watching. If you like what you saw again, leave a like, subscribe, do all that stuff that we call you do on the internet. Uh, MusicMayhem.blog. Go there. This is going to be great. Good stuff. Uh, thank you so much again for hanging out with me, and uh, we'll see you again for episode four. <gasps>